the newcomer to this team. He's got an assist in 14 games. Puck back in the left wing corner now. Matt Lee tried to get it back for Bobby May. Lost it. Stick it in front. John Harrington scores. A turnover inside of the defensive zone, and it's Harrington alone in front in the right circle, and he buries past Caden Hamming. 17-39 to go in the opening period. Prince George strikes first and takes a 1-0 lead on Harrington's 21st shot. That was knocked down. And the Warriors try to get it away there on the right side. Salandra just unable to get three. Puck comes loose back in front, bouncing, scores. Harrington in front, finds the loose handle and beats Hamming on the glove side. And Reeves got it ahead on the right wing side now for Hayden Price. Or Hunter Price who worked back in on the right wing half board. Here's Stockfish on the left wing side, try to get that puck in deep. Greaves back at the blue line with it now, walks to the middle with a shot, knocked down, loose in front, scores. And Prince George takes a three to nothing lead just over five minutes into this opening period, and it's Hunter Price's first BC Hockey League goal that does it. Builds up in the left wing half board. Bernadette walks left circle with it now. Played it along there for more. Yellow a shot, tipped in, scores! It's Brendan Nelson at the side of the net who banks it in, and the Warriors with 2.03 in the first period have some life and make it a 3-1 game. And McDonald a shot, that was stopped by Fetima. The rebound loose to the glove side. Poked below the goal line. Lusiak will come away with it. Back up top, Norlin. Left side, McDonald. High slot. Lusiak waits and shoots. He scores! Comes around the boards on the right wing. Comes back to the blue line. Charlie Banker couldn't hold it there. Bernadette with speed got by him. Jake Bernadette in alone. Scores! And the game is tied. 3-3. Good hard work by Jake Bernadette. He won the battle in the neutral zone. Took the puck away from the PG defenseman and just went in. Nice shot. Uh, he he earned that goal, Trevor. Bernadette has, and that was flashed off a stick into the right wing corner. With it there are the Spruce Kings as they pressure inside the offensive zone. Greaves, midpoint, Cameron scores! Colton Cameron from the midpoint with a drive on a heavily screened Hamming, able to beat him on the glove side. And with 12.27 to go in the second period, Prince George has their lead back again. It's 4-3. It certainly has looked like that throughout the point of this hockey game that, well, I mean, at one point, you know, we did mention it was a 4-3 game, and now it's 5-3. Lyndon Matko with a shot, and he beats Caden Hamming to make it a 5-3 score with 11.38 to go in the second period. Puck comes loose here in the left circle, trying to clear his Matt Lee. Nelson going to help him out and get the puck out to center anyhow. 25 seconds to go here in this Warrior penalty kill. McGregor Bennett for Greaves, back along right wing side. Here's Gagnon, right circle, back in front, scores! Harrington, the hat trick, goal, a power play marker, and it's 6-3 Prince George. Holding right wing corner, Norland still with it now, dropped it back up top here for Lusiak. Lusiak, got a back up top, Norland, left wing side, McDonald. McDonald left circle, middle now it's Norlin, right side, Lusiak scores! Riley Lusiak's got his second goal tonight, burying a shot over the glove side of Aiden Fetima, a power play goal for the Warriors, their second power play goal of this hockey game, and it's 6-4 to four with 2.34 to go in the second. Sounds like the first the end of the first period, down by three. A lot of chances so far in this third period for West Kelowna, who you mentioned it, Don, now leading shots, 32 to 31. Here's Mako, left wing scores, left circle, Lyndon Mako, second goal of the game with two seconds to go on the power play. And there's the difference. Fetima makes a big stop. Prince George comes back the other way and scores on the power play at 7-4. It's coming to the blocker side, two seconds to go, one ahead by Kylas Green, and that will do it in this one. A big win for the Prince George Spruce Kings who come into West Kelowna to defeat the Warriors 7-4. to four. Our final score here tonight from Royal LePage Place. John Harrington, a hat trick, part of a five-point night for the veteran Spruce King forward. And the Warriors fall to Prince George here by a final of 7-4 to four here in this one.